Today's video is my five minute summer morning makeup routine when you're in a rush. So I like to start off with Kula. This is the Daydream Mineral Primer. It has SPF 30. I like this, it makes a good um, foundation for my face. It makes a nice base for my makeup. Um, I am starting off with a cleansed and moisturized face. So I even add it to my eyes because I have very oily eyelids and I like to keep them primed uh, so that I'm not a big greasy face by the end of the day. So then I like to go in with my It Cosmetics CC Cream, uh, excuse me, CC Powder. It's the Airbrush Perfecting Powder Sheer to Full Coverage Finishing Veil. And this also has SPF 50. Uh, it says UVA, UVB. I really like this. It gives my face um, just enough color <coughs> to even it out. <coughs> while also giving me that uh, sunscreen protection. So I use my um, e.l.f. complexion brush. I love this brush. I've been using it for many, many years. Um, it applies the powder nicely without being too dense. Um, let me see, I'm gonna try to use <laughs> the viewfinder as opposed to looking in my mirror. So I just um, get that all around the face on the eyes also because again I have very oily skin particularly very oily eyelids and I just try to do as much as I can to control that um, oil <coughs> the oils on my eyelids so then um, my summer routine this is actually my um, morning routine when I'm going to work so this is like my five minute morning routine if I weren't filming I'd probably be finished already by now but then I go in with my um, black radiance true complexion contour palette it's in the color medium to dark I love this palette because as you can see I use the heck out of the contour powder it doesn't you can't really tell as much but I also use just as much of the highlight powder it just seems to go uh, a lot further. I don't use the sculpt powder. It's just not a color that um, I have found anything to do with at this point. Um, but I love this palette, this palette because as you're going to see, I can use it all over my face. So I have this It Cosmetics um, contour brush and it came in a holiday set. It actually came in a set with this It Cosmetics double-ended brush um, and I don't know there's no name on the brush so I don't know what they call this but it's a double-ended brush and this contour brush and it came in a holiday set in a cute little um, in a cute little pack let me see I don't have yes I do I have a little pack <coughs> so they came in this um, and it was just a, a little holiday gift set um, which was is nice and convenient I use that when I travel um, so I'm just going to go in with the um, contour powder and what I do, and I am going to use the mirror now because I have to really focus, <laughs> I just kind of get the powder, the contour powder um, on the face, work it in there, around the forehead, the usual suspects. Make sure I blend this in really well. I don't like to have um, streaks on my face. I really don't do the jawline. As you can see, I already have a really strong jawline, so it's really not necessary for me to um, come in on the jawline. <coughs> um, I go back into that contour powder, and I just apply it to... sides of my nose but then go in again and I put that into the crease of my eye and now this becomes my crease shade just like that go in again get a little more come in into the other crease um, I love this color um, I think it makes a really good crease color and then I just take the excess bring it down the nose then I take my e.l.f. angled blush brush. You can see it's a nice dense brush there, angled. And I go into the highlight powder. Get the highlight, come down the cheek, come down the other cheek, the high points. 
I don't go too crazy on my nose because again, I have a really oily skin and if I go too crazy on the nose, I'll be super shiny by the time I get to work. And then I go back into that highlight powder and I use it as my lid color. And I love to do this. I love this um, quick and easy routine because it is great not only for work days, but it's also great for travel. Because this way I only have to carry the one palette. I could, um, this can be my only color. I mean, if I wanna add in some other um, eyeshadow palettes as a compliment to this, <coughs> I can, but usually I don't. Um, then I go in with my um, Marc Jacobs. This is some kind of gel. I'll link the name of everything that I'm using down in the description box, but this is their um, gel eyeliner. I love this gel eyeliner because it has a twist up from the bottom, no sharpening necessary. And it stays put pretty well. It's really good for my, um, it's really good, good for my um, watery eyelids. So I have, not only do I have oily eyelids, but I also have watery eyes. And so, um, a lot of a lot of eyeliners have a hard time staying on my eyes I put them on and then by the time I get to work again they're like all down my face I'm looking like a raccoon nobody likes that look right so then <coughs> I go back into the CC powder and I use the short end of my it cosmetics brush to go underneath my eye just to set it, just to make sure that that eyeliner is not coming down. And also to make sure that once my eyelids, um, once the oils in my eyelids start to come out throughout the day, they have some powder to kind of catch them. Um, and again, I'm not looking like a raccoon by the, by the end of the day. And so this is, um, it's a good way for me to kind of get my makeup on really quickly when I'm heading to work. I'll finish up with doing my eyebrows. I'll add some mascara, some kind of lippy. Um, actually, one of my um, quickie favorite lippies is uh, Marc Jacobs. <coughs> um, I'm not sure what this product is called. Again, I'll link it in the description box below. I know the co color is called um, Cha Changes. And that's because it's like a shifty, it's like a shifty gel, and it adds a nice color. Obviously, again, this is a, a travel size. It came in a holiday set um, with some other colors. That was many years ago. I, I like to get holiday sets. Like This is great for traveling. Um, it's also great to just toss in your bag without taking up too much space. So I'm gonna finish up the rest of my face off camera. Again, I'll be um, doing my eyebrows, which need to be done right now. So I'm not gonna take time to do them on camera. And I would apply my mascara and I'm out the door. So, you know, again, if I were not filming right now, I would have been done with this, um, this look in five minutes. It's quick, it's easy, it smooths out my face, gives me, you know, makes me look alive and I'm ready to start my day. So, so I'm popping um, back on really quickly to show you. I've done my brows. I used the Anastasia Brow Wiz and I put on my mascara, which I use the It Cosmetics Hello Lashes. So here's the final look about two hours later. As you can see, my oils have started peeking through and all I need to do is a little blotting.